playing this Aphorium. I don't know why. But, uh, I played this game, I played, I played Downlink before. And hi, I, I haven't streamed or recorded a video in a while, so, yeah. I don't miss this game. But I've played this game before, but like on my own. But I, I got the shitty ending. So I'm I'm replaying it over because why not? I got nothing else to stream. And two, I got the shitty ending. So yeah. Why not run it back, you know? Run the fuck back. So yeah. Give hundred percent the story. Yup, cool. Hmm. Play this one. It's fifty hours a game. Damn. Normal again, because no, no. HUD activated. Commence briefing. Data on the subject. Kadir Suleiman, a local political figure hired to maintain order after the outbreak. His brother Hassan died in a disease-related incident before we were able to evacuate him. Suleiman blamed the GRE for Hassan's death. He stole a highly sensitive file which became his bargaining chip against the GRE, with instructions to publicize it if anything happened to him. Data on the subject, the stolen file. It details the incomplete process of synthesizing a cure for the virus. If implemented in its current state, the produced substance may be extremely toxic. Now. Also, the file contains full description of the virion structure. Any attempt to use it would result in countless lives lost. It must be recovered. Further information, current status. Suleiman sent the file to an associate unknown to us, with instructions to publicize it at his command at any time. To counter that, we instituted a citywide communication jam, preventing him from publicizing the file. Your GRE-issued radio can overcome that jamming. It is your lifeline. Do not lose it. Suleiman has since gone underground and begun using a different name. We have reason to believe he now leads one of the two main factions operating within the city. You are to find Suleiman and locate the stolen file in order to save mankind from a disaster of unprecedented proportions. I told you that wasn't a normal drop shoot. Break his limbs, then take him to rise. Back up! All of you! Stop! Loud noises draw them. Fall back! Fall back! on one arm. Oh shit, Amir's hurt? No, Amir is gone. But I'm bringing in someone who might still survive. One of us? We'll see.
I remember, but no, I couldn't. You can hear me, but I, I was saying I don't miss this game. I, I don't. I love it. It's one of my favorite zombie games, but I really don't miss this game. I'm gonna be honest. This this game gave me so much fucking anxiety, and I couldn't play it at nighttime. I, I remember I had to wait till morning time to play this fucking game. So yeah. You pinch him. You're scared. I'm not scared. Then pinch him. He blinked. What? He blinked again. What if he's a zombie? Ah! Zombie! Run! You sleep for three days like a dead man, then scare children? Off to a great start, 31. Where am I? In paradise, can't you see? Okay, enough joking around. Head to room 190. The boss will believe you. What do you mean, 31? Ask the boss. Thirty-one. That's your number. Thirty-one, in fact. It's the only way to get to the drones no. first. So? A meal died because of this guy? Quiet! Eat a dick. Fuck quiet. Now he's gonna say your asses. I'm gonna say your dumbasses. I'm looking for the boss. Is he in there? Oh, you're 31. Go on in. Looking for the. Are you the boss? What? Am I too young? You got the problem with my age? No, I. You wanted to talk to me? That's better. Do you remember anything? Know what you are? Yeah, I can. I can see this is some kind of shelter. We call it the tower. Brecken and his runners put it all together a couple of months ago, and we've been here ever since. Hunting airdrops, scavenging, and rescuing people. Yeah, I, I wanted to thank that girl. Good, because if not for her, you'd already be chewing somebody's knee bone. Your antecedent was totally crushed, by the way. Only thing Jade could salvage was your radio. Oh, Shit, great. So can uh -huh. I get that back, please? Actually, uh, I think I need it thanks. more than you do. Believe me, pal, that's not the case. Jerum? Jerum? Jerub? Take it. Jerubin? You know my runners put their lives in danger for, for guys follow, like fam. you. <laughs> So now you take the antigen meant for someone else, and you won't even share your gear with us? Jeez. Jeez. I don't have time to deal with your bullshit. Jeez. I've lost contact with one of our guys, thanks to the fucked up radios we're stuck Jeez. with. Jeez. Do something for me, would you? I don't want to see you or your precious radio anymore, so go be useful somewhere else. We don't tolerate lazy assholes here in the tower. Hey, be fair, I'm not, I'm not lazy, I'm just, hey, boss. Save it. That last guy I mentioned, he's only on the 13th floor, but he might as well be trapped in a mine cave -in. Come back later. And I'm not the boss. Too young, remember? I'm Rahim. Brecken's in charge here. Jesus, how many people died here? Oh, I don't miss this game. 
I'm getting Vietnam flashbacks. Like I like I'm getting I'm getting like serious Vietnam fucking flashbacks of of just like the worst anxiety ever. I do not fucking miss this game. <laughs> Why am I replaying? This? <laughs> like this isn't the scariest game ever. Where it's were just you? Like, We've been waiting for your report. Uh, it's been over seventy hours. I lost my radio for a while. Don't worry, my cover's intact. No contact with the tower's leader yet. Unable to confirm identity. I'm taking steps to blend in. Acknowledged. Time is of the essence, Crane. Remember that. There's, there's one more thing. I, I got bitten. I've shown no symptoms, but the people here say I'm infected. Then you'd better get your hands on some antisent ASAP. Help! You? Help! Somebody! What the hell? Oh, he's dead. Oh. <laughs> they don't, they don't give it, they don't give it, <laughs> they don't give a clear indication on when they're dead, so I was, I was just, <laughs> I forgot, like, I forgot, like, cause I remember, like, they were hard to kill, but I didn't think there was, like, a, <laughs> Like, I thought, oh, I was expecting, like, when it was, like, the Call of Duty, like, hit markers or some shit. I, for, I, I forgot, like, they taped, like, uh, I forgot, I forgot, yeah. <laughs> I cut my arm, uh, getting away from him. Oh, God, you had to kill him, didn't you? I was just kicking that nigga. <laughs> God damn it. That was, I was expecting that was to get my back brother. Up. I came down to see him and... Easy, easy. It's all right now. I'll, I'll get help. Hey, Raheem, this is Crane. I'm down here on 13. Listen, this guy of yours got fucked up pretty bad getting away from a zombie. Oh, shit. 31? You went after Mark? Is it... is it safe down there? Yeah, well, it's safe enough now. Okay, don't move. I'm sending Lena downstairs. Hey, hold still. Mark Lena will be here any minute. Ghost. You've got to find some gauze. Oh, and alcohol. Combine them. That will stop the bleeding. I try to stay calm, okay? I'll be right back. <laughs> okay, who's hurt? He's bleeding pretty bad. Let me see him. Gauze and alcohol, huh? Pretty primitive, but it'll work. Uh, Thanks for the help. I'll take care of him from here. Well done, 31. Oh, hey. hey, 31. Not bad for a new guy. Perhaps I misjudged you. Yeah, I just want to help out and repay you guys for what you did for me. Well, good. Come find me. And we'll talk about how you can do that. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Stick drift my way through the building. Oh, okay, I'm here. Whoa. All right, taken care of. Piece of cake. What else you got for me? Well, let me think. Rahim, you are just smart enough to be dangerous, you know that? 
Omar told me about your plans for the nest. Explosive charges? Really? What? Explosives? Oh, I please. Said that. You can't tell a convincing lad to save your life. I know what I'm doing. Yeah? You think you can't die? You're not my mom. No, I'm not. Our mom's dead. So you might want to be a little nicer to me since I'm the only family you have left. Especially now that Amir is gone. You're Jade, right? Right. I just wanted to thank you for what you did for me and, and tell you how sorry I am for your loss. I owe you and Amir my life. Yeah, you do. You want to return the favor? Keep my dipshit brother from killing himself. No explosives, Rahim. <laughs> no explosives. So, so, is that enough? Do I get to talk to Brecken now? First, go change your clothes. I left some new ones for you in your room. You're in 194. Something wrong with what I'm wearing? You need something that fits the job Brecken wants you to do. Call me when you've changed. All right. I went. Oh damn! It's too late. Okay, now. Raheem, I'm ready. Where do I find Brecken? Not so fast, Thirty One. If you're going to earn your keep, we have to find out if you've got the skills. So get your ass up to the gym. It's on the top floor. Just a couple flights up. Raheem, I don't see you. Where are you? Those. Oh, yeah, I was climbing. That's what I was doing. Okay. You want to feel right at home? A crane? On a crane? Shit. <laughs> you need to give me a med kit, fam. I just took fall damage. Fuck, I'm supposed to climb on. Is I'm supposed to go here? Here? <laughs> no. 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 Welcome to our gym. First things first, you've got to learn how to run. What do you mean, learn how to run? Just do what I say, all right? Now, jump down to the very bottom. Are you nuts? I'd kill myself. Don't be a wimp. Come on, you can't be serious. Watch this. Raheem! My leg! Jesus, don't move! I'll get help! Ha! I was just fucking with you! Son of a bitch! What? You can't take a joke? <laughs> Come on! <laughs> get your ass down here! Christ on a crutch. Yeah. Holy shit! Holy shit! It's a rush, isn't it? But don't blow your load just yet. There's more. To survive outside, you got to take advantage of the terrain. Most eaters suck at climbing, so the harder the terrain is, the better for you. Depends I've got some typical situations to set up for you. See.
Let's Can't see how you handle them. <laughs> Try not to slow down once you start running. Outside, if you stop, you're probably dead. Not bad for a noob. I know where I'm going, but I'm going somewhere. I'm going somewhere. I'm, I'm just pressing buttons and shit. Okay, time for the real test. Get back to the crane. Make use of anything and everything while you run. Okay, really? Really? This is what we're doing? The closest I ever came to this was running track in high school. Huh. Well, then you're a fucking prodigy. Never seen anything like it. Maybe you're a secret agent. Huh? Huh? What? What's happening to me? Crane? Shit. Shit. Oh, shit. Crane, talk to me. What's going on? Something went wrong. Raheem, what just happened to me? I don't think that's supposed to happen. Maybe it was, maybe it wasn't. I don't know. I feel like that was definitely supposed to happen, to be honest. Or was the game's fault? One of the other. I don't know. It wasn't me. I get it. Piles of trash. Dipshit. I get it. Alright. Raheem, what the fuck was that? Does this mean I'm I'm turning? Most likely no. At least not yet. Caesars remind you that you're infected. You better go see Dr. Zera though. He'll check you out, probably give you a shot of antizen. Before you head out to see Zera, talk to the quartermaster. He'll uh, gear you up so you can go outside without getting your head bitten off.
Jesus elevator like your bitch. Oh, you're the new scout. Rahim radioed me about you. Yeah, that's me. Name's Crane. I'm not gonna bother learning your name till you survive a few days, but here, this is for you. By the way, word around the tower is you're just another deadbeat in line for food or antizen. By which I mean, the people here don't much like you. But don't blame them. It's easy to get paranoid when you're isolated. And since somebody's jamming communications to the outside, there's plenty of paranoia to go around. Whole damn city with nobody to call for help but ourselves. You bring me some supplies from the airdrops, though, and you'll see people change their tunes in a hurry. That shit's a game changer. Uh, thanks. I'll bear that in mind. Listen, is there anything else? I'm in a bit of a rush. Also, if you're looking to get more popular, you can try helping folks. Do a few favors, they might like you more. Might even find a woman. Keep you warm at night. <laughs> All right. Yeah, a rusty wrench. Yeah, okay. Take this too. Dick. Going outside, yeah? Okay, new guy. Be careful out there. We've lost too many already. I'm Kyle Crane, bitch. Oh, we're all gonna know my name. Okay, noob. You got Dr. Zeta set up in a semi-trailer on a fenced and plane court. When you leave the tower, hang a left and head due south. You can't miss it. It's Crane, kid. All right, all right. Crane. Just keep moving. There's no time to take in the sight. And try not to make too much noise. Sound attracts those fuckers. I hope those Doctor? Hello? Anybody there? Camden, are you there? Damn it. Uh, so I'm supposed to get a vaccine? What? No, no. Suppressant. It's called antizen. Suppresses the symptoms here. Sit. Antizen postpones the inevitable. Best the GRE could do. Inevitable? So th there's no cure? It's a variation of rabies. There's no cure right now. But you see, I've been running tests on both antizen and off. infected tissue. That or Matt Cowdy's. A cure is possible. Definitely possible. Oh shit, you Science. really think you can figure it out? Bitch. With Dr. Camden's help, yes. I think so. Uh, now, where did I put that injector? Who's Dr. Cam? A colleague trapped in Sector Zero, where the outbreak first, well, broke out. We've been collaborating via radio, though we would have made more progress if the connection were better. Also, if my earlier experiments had borne fruit. I tried injecting recombined versions of the virus into chunks of meat and leaving them around the city, hoping some of the infected would eat them so I could observe and document the results. But they didn't? Uh, it bore no fruit. I'm ashamed that I wasted so much time on it. No reason to hold any antizen in reserve now. In any case, all right, I'm quite busy, so on your way now. What was I doing? Keep it fast. Raheem, Zara checked me out and gave me another shot. Okay, great. Now that'll hold you for a while. Pussy. Which is good, because I'm starting to get used to the idea of bossing you around. So, time for a real trial. Go talk to Spike. You'll find him near Zeta's truck. He's got the first real job for you. Pussy. Asshole. 
Eat a dick. I know that loves you. I'll be honest, I'm just taking a detour and just kicking them. <laughs> I perfectly took a detour just to kick them. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> hey, Spike. I'm Crane. Just what I need. More unskilled labor. All right, shut up and pay attention. There are two types of airdrops. One has food, first aid supplies, survival gear and such. The other kind is filled with antisense. The GRE sends in a one-way video feed that lets us know when they're on the way. But the trouble is, the airdrops with Anderson keep getting raided by Rise's thugs. And without Anderson, we're basically screwed. Rise and his boys only operate during the day, because going out after dark is a dandy way to get killed. But the next two Anderson drops are coming down right at sunset tonight, and Bracken means to go after them. This may be our only chance to reach the airdrop. What's my part here? Well, as I said, going out at night is basically suicide. Or it would be if I hadn't been. So he's sending me to suicide. Setting up safe zones and traps out there for weeks now, which I have. <laughs> Parkour. 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 Par Park, 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 parkour. Parkour, parkour, parkour. Parkour, park. Sub parkour. Okay, Jade, I'm here, along with some infected. Watch yourself. Sub parkour. I think it's too late for this guy. Shit. All right. Finish it. Just don't let him suffer. Okay, it's done. Fuck. You had no choice. He wasn't human anymore. Now hurry. You still need to turn on the lights. That's the only way to make this place safe at night. Wait, where? Oh. Right in front of me, okay. Ah, shit. How's it coming? Got the lights on? Uh, almost. Just give me a second. I talked to my boss <laughs> that you can't find out about, you know? This new thing I'm shady or some shit, you know? It's called lying, you know? Crane here. Report. Okay, I met this doctor, scientist type. They've got him set up in a sort of research trailer, and he's working on a cure for the virus. His name is Zara. Serious. Hello? Serious. Do you copy? Affirmative. Secondary Fire. objective added. Maintain your cover and secure all of his research. Acknowledge. Your stolen file still takes top priority though, right? Affirmative. We find it unlikely that a single researcher working out of a trailer could produce any significant results. I'm not funny. But I realize does, that. I've said this it. like six or seven times. I'm not that funny. And I realize that. Like, coming up with shit on the fly Jade, is kind it's of done. Hard. Good. We'll need to prepare more places like that one. We've got more spots picked out for future safe zones. Spike will mark them on your map later. And Crane. Thank you. Back to you, Spike. Right now, you need to get back to our main task and arm the next trap. There's another car close by. Got it. <laughs> yeah. 
Infected are all over the street. So what does that tell you? Keep off the street. Try to stay on the rooftops where they can't reach you. They're all oh, around the car, Spike. Firecracker. You still have some firecrackers, don't you? Just throw some into the crowd. Those dead bastards are easily distracted. Alright, what was I doing? Ah. Where's the fucking hell? Oh, well. Come on, come here. Some good dark feet and a big back. <laughs> All done with the car spike. Like these freaks are everywhere. If I need to use a trap, how do I activate it? You can't. I told you, they're only for the night mission. Shit. Okay. We're fucked, basically. Yes. Okay, I was... That was a leap of faith there, I'm gonna be honest. I, I, I thought for sure I was gonna fucking <laughs> die there for a second. I thought what I had to fall down. Oh, I would've been fucked. Well, no, no. I would've done like a chip of damage. I could do that too, bitch. Spike was really trying to get you fucking killed right here, I'm not gonna lie. Like he like he's like, good luck. You know? Newbie. Uh -huh. I know nighttime is dangerous as fuck. And this is basically a suicide mission, fuck, but Spike, hey. the whole goddamn district went down. What the hell's going on? To like Spike after a while, but we're defenseless here. Plus, the safe zones and some of my traps are down too. We need to keep that power up and running ASAP. No shit, Spike. No shit. Come on, dance over here. Let's dance over here. Come on, come on, come on. Let's dance. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Hit me. Hit me. Hit me. No. Let's dance. Come on. Right there. Come on. You almost have it. Okay. 
I don't actually gotta fucking fight him. Wait, what? I don't actually, I don't actually gotta fight him. Hold up. Alright, I've got the substation reset. But if the grid shorted once, you know it could happen again, right? You leave the electrical engineering to me, okay? Just get your ass to a safe zone. You're gonna have to spend the night there. Already on dipshit. <laughs> All right, let me take a fucking nap in peace. Oh, oh shit. Crane. Crane! What can I do for you? I just saw this freaking weird zombie. He's covered in big green blisters. It, it hauled ass as soon as it spotted me. You know anything about it? Mm, not enough information, I'm afraid. But if you see another one, do let me know, will you? Hmm. Alright. I think that was good. Okay, give me a sec. Crane. Hi. First of all, you did great out there. From now on, if you need something, come see me. And to start with, use a UV flashlight hey, and a remote move. control. Yeah. You run up on a volatile, give him a face full of UV, or lead him into a trap which you can trigger with that remote. You got it? Got it. I never actually Perfect. killed a volatile. Now for the bad news. Except Despite your efforts, Brecken's mission failed. Shit, is he okay? He's alive, but you need to get back to the tower. Jay called all the scouts in, and that means you. Watching this on fucking uh, Twitch, or the VOD, you know. Uh, YouTube is Nasir2005. TikTok is Nasir2005 too. And if you're watching on YouTube, um. Uh, Twitch is Nasir 2005 and uh, TikTok is Nasir. Well, no, no, no. Twitch is Nasir 205. Way different, way short. Well, one zero out. So, yeah, because Nasir 205 is taken for some fucking reason. I don't know. I'm still mad about that. But, um, oh, yeah. Uh, and if you're on YouTube, uh, thanks for like the fucking 100 subs. I mean, shit. I didn't think I actually get like fucking 10 subs, let alone 100. So yeah, and then TikTok too. I mean, shit, I'm almost at a hundred subs. I'm almost at a hundred followers on TikTok, so that's kind of cool. Still, you know, small milestones and shit. You know, I mean, shit, it's kind of a big milestone. Fuck, I mean, shit, I never thought I actually reached like fifty followers or fifty fucking subs on anything. So yeah, if you if you watch the TikToks and you've enjoyed them, you know, I've been posting on YouTube. You know, it's a uh, is longer form content i also stream on twitch and um yeah and if you, to the youtube peoples too um if you fuck with uh youtube I, I stream these videos on um twitch you know uncut and shit like that way longer way more boring but yeah uh but uh thanks for like you know if you've like subbed or followed or anything you know thanks you know this is a small milestone i'm almost at you know, 100 followers on TikTok. Uh, I've reached uh, 103 subs on YouTube now. And I don't know. I, I haven't really gotten to say, like, thanks, I guess. I don't know. It's, uh, it was it was weird when I hit it. And I was like, eh, cool. You know? Because, I don't know. And, like, yeah. If you watch the shorts or watch the TikToks, I post, like, longer form content. And, like, I've always been like, well, nobody's really watched the longer form content. So, yeah. But, um, yeah. I guess people really fuck with the short content. I mean, you just posting random clips from Red Dead or Overwatch or from these streams or videos. So, um, 
uh, yeah. This is a long outro. As this was, this is like an outro just to kind of say uh, thanks, I guess. You know, thanks for watching, thanks for following, uh, thanks for subbing. Considering I haven't like uploaded in a while either. Um, well, I've been uploading a lot of shorts on YouTube and a lot of TikToks and TikTok and shit like that. But um, yeah, and if you followed on Twitch too, um, uh, G G Grub, I think I got your name, G Grub, G Grubbin. I don't know, G Grub him. You got me? I don't know how's your name. We followed like tonight, so thanks, I guess. I mean, I, I probably dipped out of stream, but yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Um, this is just a long outro. Just to say, uh, if you're watching this, you know, thanks, I guess. You know, thanks for making it this far. Thanks for, you know, watching. Um, but uh, yeah, it's been your motherfucking boy. I'm gonna uh, go fucking pass out or some shit because it's 4 a.m. So, um, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's been your motherfucking boy. Uh, this is the new series on, on, uh, YouTube, I guess. Um, but, uh, yeah, if, uh, if you enjoyed the content so far, uh, like, sub, dislike, I don't know. Uh, like, sub, dislike, follow, I don't know. Do whatever you feel like doing. I'm, I'm not your fucking boss. I got guns in your head. So, um, yeah. Fuck with you. Apparently, if you're watching this, you fuck with me. But, um, yeah. <laughs> it's, um, it's been a motherfucking boy. And, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. Thanks for following. Thanks for liking and all that shit. And, um, yeah, it's been a motherfucking boy. And, um, yeah. I am.